okay? Now, the next challenge I like to, for you to do is one, two, reset. So here's how it works. <clears throat> do you have a ball? Let's have a ball. You have a ball? I'm going to have you two do it right here, just up close to the net. Okay, maybe just from the, like from the service line. So when you strike the ball, Grace, you're going to say one, and then you'll say one when you strike it, then two, and then you say reset right after you say two, and then right after you strike and two, you say reset. And so you'll count, it's individual, one, one, two, reset, two, reset, like that, okay? So just do it a little, just rally a little bit like that. Two, say reset, good. Excellent. All right. Okay, good. And then when you, if you miss on one, you just reset. You say reset. Now, that's one way of doing it. So when you, when you count it just yourself, you're really focused on yourself. What this does is it helps with timing. If you call it out loud, it helps with breathing. So you're breathing at the right moment. You're breathing as you hit, as you, you exhale, as you strike the ball, which is where you want your breath to go into the ball. Does that make sense? Um, you've probably heard that before, right? You want to breathe out when you strike the ball. That's why you hear the pros, you know, some of them a little bit more obnoxious than others, but they go, ha 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 right? They're breathing, right? Um, and so, but this timing, rhythm, okay, is what you're really, it really focuses you on here. Now, you could do it together. You could go, one, someone would say one, the next person says two, and then you both say one, which is the first set of that. Then the next time it's one, two, two, one, two, three, one, two, four. See how many sets you can get of two. If you miss, you just start over where you left off. One. That's one, the first set, right? So let's do it here. I'll, I'll help you count the sets real quick. Ready? Let go. So go. So that's one, two. That's one set. One, two. That's two. One, two. That's three. Okay, stop. So instead of saying reset, you're counting the number of set that you're on. Let's see how many sets you can get in one minute. Okay, I'm going to time you. So back up to the baseline. And we'll do one minute, and you're and if you if you miss, just pick up where you left off. So you got to do complete sets. So here's here's how you do it. So ready, go. One, two, you count two, Grace. One, two, four, one, two, five. One, two, six, one, two, seven. It's all right. If it goes over, keep playing it. Two, eight, one, two, nine. Excellent. Up, up, up. Two, ten. Two, twelve. One, two, thirteen. Good pace. One, up, 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 up. Two, fourteen. All right, almost. Okay, time. Okay, so fourteen sets of two. That's how many balls? Twenty-eight in sixty seconds. Right. So the 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 goal you would shoot for is fifty balls, fifty and above in sixty seconds. What has to be achieved there as far as uh, speed and like height? What do y'all have to start matching with each other? The pace. the pace or the speed of the ball and the height. the height of the ball. If you can keep the height of the ball and the speed of the ball similar, you can rack up that number. Now, 
when you do it one, two, reset, instead of just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, what do you think is that you feel the difference is? Do you, do you sense there's a difference? Uh, a little, I guess. Okay. What do you, th what do you think? I mean, you've only start, done this one time, but what do you, what do you think? I'm thinking with the other person more. I guess when you two, like, are all together. Right, you're, you're working together. It's more of a cooperative right. challenge. Okay. The other thing that happens, and if you do this long enough, you'll realize this, that you're actually not focused on the big number, you're focused on the small number, the one, two, reset. So you're always constantly resetting. Once you go one, two, one, you throw it away, right? It's there. One, two, two. One, two, three. So you're, you're throwing away this big number, and so what happens to your, your emotions? Do they stay calm or do they ramp up? Because you're like, I'm getting closer, I'm getting closer. Is that... Yeah, it's not happening, right? You're not. So let's do it one more time where you, uh, let's try to beat your number of 14 sets, okay? So you focus on the one, two, one. And everybody, both of you call it out at the same time. Ready? Go. One, two, five, one. And one of the things that they can do is a player can actually count it in their head silently, or they can, I have players count out loud to begin this challenge because if they hear it, if they, will, they will learn it faster. They have, a, they have a sense of they're involved, fully engaged. Then they're, maybe they go to a whisper, and then after that, they want to hear it very loudly in their head. Once it becomes loud in their head, now they're starting to get into flow because their, their mind is so fully engaged um, in that. Let's go, let's go. Come on, let's go. Keep going. All right. Time. All right, how many did you get? 13. Okay, that's, that's okay. So, so... <clears throat> Let's do it one more time, but this time I'm giving you two minutes, okay. okay? So two minutes, a little bit more conditioning, but I want you, are you hearing it in your head, Grace? You are, that's fine, that's, fine. that's great. Like, so the progression is you call it out loud, then you maybe whisper it to you, and then you start to hear it in your head, and that's fine with me. As long as you're, like, I like to, when, when, I, when I have players do this, I like for them to at least like whisper it so that their air, that their breath goes out of their body. If you want to just breathe, if you're used to that, that's fine with me. But it's, you're trying to get the breath out of you because when you get the breath out of you, the nerves, you tend to relax, right? If you hold your breath, what starts to happen, Grace? Yeah, you start to get tense and that transfers into the striking of the ball, okay? Because, okay. So let's do it one more time. You're gonna get two minutes this time. Ready? And begin. All right, so let me, I do this in a one minute challenge, a two minute challenge, and a three minute challenge. Uh, a lot of times players will do better in the two minute and three minute challenges, well, especially the two minute, rather than the one minute. Uh, but uh, they will typically you know, rise to the occasion, uh, but, and the numbers sometimes, well, a lot of times I've experienced that the numbers actually work out even overall. So you just have to experiment with your players and see how that works for them. All right, that's okay. Come on, keep it up. Match your tempo and the height of the ball. Focus, focus on the counting. And time. Okay, come on back to the net. Noah, what did you what did you sense as far as f being fully engaged in this warm up? Because this after this is a warm up challenge. What did you sense in your engagement? I'm pretty focused. You're pretty focused, right? On a scale from one to ten, what do you think it was? Ten is I'm totally in, coach. 
Seven or eight, good. You at least want to be a seven. You at least want to feel like you're a seven. Anything above that is just bonus, right? Yeah. All right, how, what was your total count? Uh, 27, okay. So you, you, you're getting, you, well, you basically doubled it, yeah. right? Right, and that's what you're going to typically find. Now, um, you know, the more you do this, the more you're going to begin to fall into what I call a flow state. Um, I didn't call it. That's what it's called. Um, I equate it to a play state where you're fully engaged, you're feeling and performing your best. Could, do you feel like you started to get into a flow? Yes. Yeah. And there was a sense of rhythm and timing. You were timing his, uh, you were trying to match his speed. You were trying to match her height, things like that. And did you start to quickly recognize when the ball was short or when the ball was deep? Right. So, uh, and this, so this is a warm-up. <laughs>